Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is another hair video. Did you really expect anything else from me other than hair video? I'm gonna start branching out into more videos soon, but we gotta get the coin. This is where the coin is coming from, hair video sponsors. I just put on lip gloss, so that's probably a bad idea because the hair is getting stuck to my lip gloss now. This hair was sent to me by Beauty Forever Hair. This is my first time trying their hair and I'm impressed. I always see good reviews on their hair and I just never really bought it on my own. So whenever they reached out to me, I was like, hmm, I've been seeing good things about you, so I'm going to try you. I um, picked out this wig and they sent it to me, so I'm so glad I picked this one. I've actually been seeing a lot of people reviewing this hair, this like highlight wig look. And I've loved it and I've wanted to buy it myself, but I just never did, so... Mm hmm I got to try it. It's so pretty. It's giving me like Beyonce. Am I reaching when I say Beyonce? Like I'm reaching when I say Beyonce, but it's giving me something similar to Beyonce. I don't know. I just keep touching it because it's so soft and look at this. I just run my fingers through. And there's no there's no shedding. I didn't even realize that okay, there's one piece. I just really ripped that out myself. Let you guys go ahead and watch me do the hair. I swear he's blowing the leaf right here on purpose. He's already blowing right here. Why is he that? So yeah, I'm just gonna let you guys go ahead and watch me install the wig and everything and I will see you guys in the next I'll see you guys in the next clip next time. I don't know.
for you, I'm in the rock. I didn't in my sock, so I'm running from my heart. And I shoot that heart.
guys. So I did um, finish installing. I think I left off with me straightening the hair and cutting it in the last clip, I believe. Um, so I switched the part to the middle part because I just wasn't really feeling the side part because the blonde wasn't like equally, like it's not, the blonde isn't like equally under here. So I was like, okay, maybe this needs to go back to the middle part so you can see the blonde. And I did curl it like a couple, like maybe 30 minutes ago. And I was trying to show me curling it, but my camera died. So I had to stop and let my um, camera charge up a little bit. So I believe I'm gonna go back in and just curl it a little bit more because you can see the curls kind of fail. I didn't spray them because I don't really want it to be like a super curled look. I just want something loose like this. So let me just pick up a couple pieces and show you guys how I curl it. This hair though is super, super silky. Like, do you ever just like get hair, like a wig from a company, and whenever you curl it, it just starts to feel so rough? I don't know if rough is the word to describe it, but like, it's like harder to even run your fingers through it. Like it loses its silkiness when you put heat on it. Well, mainly curl it because this hair does not do this. I was not expecting this hair to feel as silky as it does because for one, it is bleached. I'm, not really sh I'm pretty sure they did bleach it though. But it is bleached, so I was not expecting it to feel as smooth and soft and silky as it does. It feels amazing. Now, I'm not gonna go back in and curl like the whole thing like I did the first time because I really just wanted to get like some, I don't know, like some type of flow to it instead of it just being bone straight. It didn't really look the best bone straight because I feel like whenever you have colored hair or like highlights, it's it looks better whenever it's curled. I don't know, I just feel like straight hair with highlights and um, highlights or color just looks best. Unless it's, like, unless it's one color, I just feel like it looks best curled and I'm not really one to wear curled hair so this is really the only time I do curl hair. I should probably cut more layers into it but I really don't feel like it because I'm being lazy now. I don't feel like cutting more layers. So just gonna let y'all watch me curl it a little bit. I'll be back. Okay guys, so this is the finished look of the hair. I love this, like I love this. If it even had like a little bit more blonde in it, it's giving, it's giving grown woman. <laughs> it's giving grown woman to me. Like I love hair that's this length. Like, I don't know, I just can't get with the super long hair anymore. That's kind of why I cut it also. Cause I'm just like not feeling the 22, 24, 26. I don't know guys, but. This is cute. Now, I'm gonna tell you guys, I'm gonna be straight up and honest. Um, I mean, this isn't like a bad thing. There's only two complaints that I have about the hair. I won't say they're complaints, just things I wish were different. The first thing is I wish the blonde was a little bit more throughout, like in the back. Um, 
there's not really like a lot of blonde unless you like pull some of the hair from the front into the back to kind of cover it the parting space you don't really get too much on the sides you can't really do a deep part because 13 by 4 and like i've said before like a million times i don't like 13 by 4 so it stops right here your part so i feel like if it went back a little bit more it would be like my dream wig what was the other one i was going to say what was the other one i can't remember i don't remember the third one I need to say it. I need to say it because I don't remember. But other than that, the hair is super duper nice. Like, this is so pretty. You see me? There's a man blowing leaves. So I'm sorry if you guys can hear that. I'm just gonna wait till he leaves. I didn't think that I would like brown hair this much because I don't know. I just feel like brown doesn't really look that best on my skin. I remember the third thing I was gonna say. Third thing I was gonna say is the lace. It's like super light. Like it comes transparent, I believe. And I just feel like transparent lace is so hard to like tint if it's not super thin. And like if I hold my head back, y'all can probably see there's like a white cast. I put makeup on it. Um, I did not spray it with my lace tint, but my lace tint, I don't know. I feel like it doesn't tint. Um, I feel like my lace tint doesn't really tint transparent lace that good. So I like to get a nice medium brown lace most of the time. So yeah, that's it for the hair, you guys. If you guys like this hair, it's going to be down below in the description box. You guys can check it out and purchase one. I highly, highly, highly recommend you guys purchase it because it's so nice. And if you're somebody like me that sucks at literally bleaching hair, trying to highlight it, this is for you. There's no work to it. You just get it. You can bleach the knots. I bleached the knots a little bit. So, um, yeah, if you guys are into low maintenance hair, I haven't to do too much to it. I highly recommend you guys get it. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you aren't already. I will see you guys in the next video because I'm about to go take some pictures. I'm about to take some pictures. We're going to get the pic today. Oh my God, this is. If one more spam caller, call me. I really hope you guys enjoy watching me install this wig and style it. I'll see you guys in my next video. So until next time, bye guys.